Hi folks, welcome back to College Hill Farm. Well, I would like to make this a video response to a comment I got uh, some time ago. And, and the guy was not, I don't think he meant it to be rude, but he was being rude. Uh, and what he actually said was that uh, he applauded me for my attempts to stay busy, but at the same time, he wondered why I didn't apply the same amount of effort to lose weight. Well, you know, I'm a big guy. I've been a big guy all my life. And uh, there are a lot of other big guys out there that will tell you they've been big guys all their life. And it's that saying to lose weight is a lot easier said than done. And most of the times, the ones that say that are little skinny fellas anyway. They were born genetically to be that way. Okay? It was genetic. They were going to be that way. My dad was a big guy. His dad was a big guy. Okay? Uh... Is there some nature nurture thing in that? Yeah, I'm sure there is. But uh, it's one of those things that, that uh, that's not your business. Just saying, it's not your business. Uh, the way I live my life is not your business. Okay? It's, it's that damn simple. It's not your business. Now, you may have pissed me off a little bit. That's okay. I'll get over it. People have said things to me before that's made me mad, and, and I got over it after I told them the way I felt about it. Now, I don't know. Does it seem to you like people are getting ruder these days than they used to be? When I was a kid, uh, people didn't seem to be as rude. Kids have always been rude to each other, okay? Kids have always been rude to each other. But the adults were never so openly rude as they are today. And I'm going to tell you why I think that is. Uh, when I was a kid, uh, we'd had all, all the names I'm going to use here are fictitious. There are nobody in my family. So if my family's watching this video, I'm not talking about you if I use your name. Don't, don't think I am. Uh, when I was a kid, every family had that uncle, okay? He was just a butthole. He was just hateful. He didn't like nobody. He was rude to everybody. You know who I'm talking about, Uncle Will. Uh, and everybody in the family knew he was that way, and they just tried to avoid him because he was just old and hateful and, and rude. And you just avoided him. That was what you did. And uh, he pretty much avoided everybody else. But not in today's society. What's going on today is, while my family might have had an Uncle Will, and there was 50 or 60 of us in the family, uh, we might have had an Uncle Will, one. But on the Internet now, Uncle Will finds Uncle Tom, and Uncle Bill, and Uncle whatever. And next thing you know, there's a whole passel of rude old guys or rude people on the internet that have got together and they like to be rude. They're just that way. They're buttholes. They've always been buttholes, but now they've got a place to show their butt. You know, people show their butt when they, when they get a chance. People will tell you who they are if you pay attention to them. You know, life's just that way. Uh, for example, let's say that there's a crazy guy, and I had plenty of crazy folks in my family. I know crazy's a bad word. Mentally ill is probably a better word. But I had plenty of those. Yeah, I still got better. I had plenty of those, and uh, they had weird ideas. People coming to get them, and and the government was out to get them, and this one was out to get them. They were always paranoid, and and uh, now the one in my family has met up with the one in another family, and him and the one in another family, and another family, until there's 10,000 of them. And they've all got into one little group on Facebook. And next thing you know, 
There's conspiracy theories everywhere because they've got a platform to say this crazy crap. Uh, so it's hard sometimes to to not to realize that some of these people are not right. Okay, they're just not right. Uh, they would do awful things to you if they could. They're just awful people. And the best thing you can do to, to, uh, to be about awful people is not be one. Don't be that way. You know, if it's not saying something good about somebody, shut your mouth. Okay, if you're not being good to somebody, hush. You're not being good. Okay, I don't know if I put this up on the channel or not, but... You know, that's just one of those things. If you ain't got something good to say, shut up. Love you all.